Alright guys, quick video here for you today because a few days ago we did get a pretty cool announcement because it has been confirmed we are getting another LEGO Horizon set which is something that I've wanted for a while uh, I did pick up the Tall Neck set that they released a while ago and ever since then I've been hoping we would get some more of these, potentially an entire line and while an entire line hasn't been confirmed we do have one more set that is confirmed to be coming out which is the Aloy and Varl versus Shell Walker and Sawtooth set. Which is pretty much exactly what the name implies it to be. You get two little minifigures of Aloy and Varl. Which I believe the Aloy figure is the same as the one that came with the tall neck. But of course the Varl one is all new. And you also get the Shell Walker and Sawtooth machines. As well as, you know, a few little set pieces such as a campfire and such. So this set is clearly based on the recently released LEGO Horizon Adventures game. Although I will point out that the designs of these machines and their designs in the game do differ a bit. Uh, I assume that was probably a cost factor involved in that decision. I'd assume they want to keep the price of this thing as low as possible, especially compared to, you know, some of the LEGO sets that can get to some really ridiculous prices. But the pre-orders for this thing is up on Amazon at least, and it is going for 45 bucks, which is not bad, I don't think, uh, compared to the price of the tall neck. I think it was 80 if I remember right. Which, of course, the tall neck was obviously a much larger set than this one. But smaller set, smaller price, so I think it works out fine. So I'm really glad we're finally getting another LEGO set from Horizon. I still believe that this IP just has a lot of potential for future LEGO sets if they continue this line. Which, with the release of the LEGO Horizons game, I think that is very likely. At this point, I don't believe this will be the last one of these we see. And there's really a lot of things they can do with this. Obviously, all the different machines can be sets, especially the bigger ones like a Tremor Tusk or Rock Breaker or Thunder Jaw or Stormbird, you know, things like that. But beyond that, I think there's a lot of different sort of play sets like this they could do. We could get a Bandit Camp. Uh, we could get a Nora Village. We could get a Banuke Encampment. Uh, if they wanted to go really crazy and do a really big set, we could potentially get Meridian, which would be a very large set and would probably cost about, you know, three arms, two legs, and your left nut. But, you know, <laughs> what are you going to do? So, I definitely would like to see more of these in the future, and I think it's really likely that we will at this point. But, for now, we do have this one confirmed, which I believe is set to be released next March, if I remember right. So, I probably will be picking this up when it comes out next year. But, anyway, I guess that's all i got to say, so. Lots of luck to you and yours.